Hello, you beautiful beans. So honored to be doing this work with you. And that's to speak a little about last video. That's something that the Divine Mother wanted to bring through is like, she's so appreciative of our service on this earth plane. Um, what we're transmuting and healing for the collective is so significant and it's just like a real honor to do this with you guys to do this work i've been sitting with a lot of energies a lot of feelings and just feeling how the divine mother the light is um, transmuting and uh, really moving it through my container. It's like bringing up so much density. Um, it's like I can feel like almost like rocks coming out my eyes, like so much of these heavier energies just coming up and out. Uh, like so much, it feels very physical. It feels so much like one of my teachers, Craig Holiday, often talks about in the lineage of Sri Aurobindo, of how we are in reality transforming these animal bodies into divine bodies and it's like we're already that we're already divine beings we're already fully awakened consciousness it's just that we've chosen to descend into these vessels that are in a state that are traumatized that are kind of like the cells in these bodies are asleep. The DNA isn't fully activated. Um, and so we descend into these lineages, these bodies that are, these bodies that are, you know, attached to these lineages with a lot of trauma in it. And it's like, it's a perfect orchestration. There's a beautiful intelligence of which bodies our particular soul chooses to incarnate into, chooses to descend into based on what it wants to learn in a human lifetime, based on how it wants to liberate itself in a deeper and fuller way. And so what, what the Divine Mother really wants to share in this video is that the alchemy is the gift the alchemy is the gift this isn't about your healing and then all of a sudden this is the reward in this life isn't that you heal and then you just feel amazing all the time and you're free of pain you're free of suffering it's like we didn't come here for that experience our souls can have that experience in other places our souls came here for the experience of transformation. Our souls came here because they knew they would be bestowed the gift of feeling. It's like feeling is the gift here. It doesn't matter what you're feeling. Just that you have the capacity to feel as deep as you do is the gift. And so when we recognize that, it's like that's when we can really feel like there's always, you'll notice when you're sitting with something difficult and it's teaching you how to surrender to it in a deeper and more fuller way, you'll probably, if you listen deeply, there's something in you that is so like, oh my gosh, this is it. Like this is what I came here for. It's like when you feel like in the alchemy itself is your home. Your home isn't on some other star system or some other experience maybe you can feel that you've had. It's like your, your true home is in the center of the alchemy, of the transformation that's taking place in your body. It's like right in the middle of that is home. And so when you are sitting with difficult things, when you're feeling these heavier energies wash through your body, when you can feel the light, it's like the light wants to go in so deep into our bodies. When you can feel it just penetrating so deep into your cells and your physical body, and it's just like incinerating darkness, it's incinerating density. 
it's like almost like if you were going to go dig something in Colorado, like if you're going to go build a home in the Colorado mountains, it's like you'd be coming up against rock, you know, and it'd be so dense and, and you would need like so much, you would need like these incredible tools just to be able to penetrate the density. It's like, that's what's happening in our bodies. And if, if there's, you, if you're able to connect to the part of you that came here for this experience, that is just so in love with this process of alchemy, alchemy, with this process of the light incinerating the darkness, the, the denser feelings, you're going to feel really at home in this. You're going to start to feel a lot safer. And you're going to start to feel like this, oh, thank you for this. Thank you for this gift of being on the cutting edge of evolution, Divine Mother. And you're going to stop reaching for and longing for only being in the light. You're going to stop clinging to the light and you're going to and you're going to feel a lot more free in this reality. You're going to you're going to feel so much more liberated. And that's the key here. Our souls came to this reality for a deeper liberation. And that liberation is in is in really embracing um the beauty of alchemy and the perfection of of what's happening on planet earth right now. And so I hope that this um, video helps you to let go of that longing and that clinging to the light and wanting a different experience than you're having. Because when you really feel into to, to the gift of alchemy itself, to the gift of just being able to feel, that's going to bring you so much more in the present moment. And it's going to lessen your suffering dramatically. And and to know that you came here for this. And this is a gift. And to enjoy it. And to really, really give yourself over to this process of alchemy. You know, it's like you don't even have to do it. The divine is doing it for you. Just to the best of your ability, see if you can be on board with it. And see if that might change your experience of all this intense and dramatic and just rapid transformation that's happening right now on Gaia. So, so much love to you all. It's such an honor to be here. Like I said, walking this path with you and just a huge bow of respect to all of your guys' incredible service that you just, that you decided or were chosen to come to this earth to offer. I mean, it's, it's no small matter. It, it's, it's so huge. Um, the the service you guys are offering um, in these bodies right now. So, so much love. Namaste.